Welcome to our deep dive into the consequences of overfishing. The ocean, which covers more than 70% of our planet, is a vital source of food, jobs, and recreation. However, the practice of overfishing is rapidly depleting this precious resource, leading to dire consequences. Overfishing occurs when more fish are caught than the population can replace through natural reproduction. This unsustainable practice has led to a significant decline in fish populations. Species like the Atlantic cod and bluefin tuna have seen their numbers drop by more than 90% in recent decades. The first major consequence of overfishing is the depletion of fish stocks. When key species are overfished, it disrupts the entire marine ecosystem. Predatory fish, which rely on these species for food, struggle to survive, leading to a cascade of negative effects throughout the food web. Another significant impact is habitat destruction. Many fishing methods, such as bottom trawling, destroy critical habitats like coral reefs and seagrass beds. These environments are essential breeding and nursery grounds for many marine species. Without them, the ocean's biodiversity suffers greatly. Overfishing also has profound socioeconomic consequences. Coastal communities that rely on fishing for their livelihoods face economic hardship as fish populations decline. Jobs are lost, and traditional ways of life are threatened. This can lead to increased poverty and social instability. The economic impact extends beyond local communities. The global fishing industry, worth billions of dollars, is at risk. As fish become scarcer, prices rise, making seafood less accessible and affordable. This affects not only consumers, but also the entire supply chain, from fishers to retailers. Overfishing also affects food security. Millions of people worldwide depend on fish as their primary source of protein. As fish stocks dwindle, so does the availability of this crucial food source, particularly in developing countries where alternatives are limited. Addressing overfishing requires global cooperation and stringent regulations. Sustainable fishing practices, such as catch limits and protected marine areas, are essential. Scientific research and monitoring can help ensure that fish populations are managed responsibly. There is hope for recovery if we act now. Success stories from places like the United States and Australia show that with effective management, fish populations can rebound. Implementing sustainable practices globally can restore balance to marine ecosystems and secure a future for our oceans. Public awareness and advocacy play crucial roles in combating overfishing. By supporting sustainable seafood choices, participating in conservation efforts, and advocating for stronger policies, individuals and communities can make a difference. Overfishing is a critical issue with far-reaching consequences. It threatens marine biodiversity, disrupts ecosystems, undermines economies, and endangers food security. But with concerted effort and sustainable practices, we can turn the tide. Choose sustainable seafood, support conservation initiatives, and advocate for responsible fishing practices. Thank you for watching and let's work towards a healthier, more sustainable future for our oceans.